So Samsung launched the Galaxy Note 10 and Note 10 Plus and one thing they both lack is a headphone jack. They are the first Galaxy flagship to say goodbye to the beloved analog port. And you may be wondering why, why there was a need for the removal of the port. Luckily Samsung seems to have appreciated the backslash and thus prepared a couple of explanations. First off, getting rid of the jack meant the batteries in the phones got bigger by 100mAh because of the reclaimed space inside. So the Galaxy Note 10 would have only shipped with 3400mAh battery had the jack been in, while the Galaxy Note 10 Plus would have made to do with 4200mAh battery. Next up, the removal of the headphone jack made it possible to improve the haptic vibration system in the Galaxy Note 10 and Note 10 Plus by essentially filling the hole that would have been necessary to fit the headphone jack port. Obviously, you will need to decide for yourself whether those explanations are enough to persuade you to buy one of those handsets in spite of jack's removal. One thing is clear though the Galaxy S11 family wouldn't surprise anyone if it shows up snatch the jack 2 following the lead of this year notes. Also maybe it's time to wave goodbye and say rip to the headphone jack once for all now that even the last and big holdout in the mobile world has curbed and took it away. So guys that was a quick update from Samsung. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below and hey if you found this video helpful please give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for stay updated about latest tech and gadgets. Thanks for watching.